Do I really need that? Is a question leading doctor groups are encouraging patients to ask. The American Board of Internal Medicine Foundation released a list of 90 tests and treatments now considered overused, often unnecessary, and in some cases, harmful. We're in the age of preventative medicine. So part of preventing medicine is not to test for things we don't need. Specialty groups representing more than 350,000 doctors weighed in. The American Society for Clinical Pathology says tests for vitamin D and low-risk HPV are over-prescribed. The ASCP says a lack of vitamin D rarely causes serious conditions and over-the-counter supplements and more sun exposure can easily boost levels. It happens to be an overutilized test and does cost the healthcare sector a fair amount of money each year. An HPV test is commonly run as part of an annual gynecological exam, but Dr. Holliday says there are high and low risk versions done at the same time. The high risk is helpful for screening cancer risk. The low risk test that's been around for many, many years is still ordered by clinicians, but has no relationship to the development of cervical cancer. Other practices now under scrutiny include giving heartburn medication to infants with reflux. They're not proven to work and may have side effects. Inducing labor if a healthy mother has missed her due date. It could lead to an unneeded C-section. And using feeding tubes in patients with advanced dementia. Helping them to eat is better. Mike Gracia, The Associated Press.